Hey guys and welcome back to another video. Hope you are okay on that side of the screen. And have you ever seen an SD card that can reach up to 400 megabytes per second? If you didn't, then stay tuned because these are capable of. We are talking about the Sabrent Rocket V60 SD cards, which are awesome. Unboxings are boring, as you guys know, but Sabrent really goes up to the detail. And when we unbox an SD card like this, we have everything like we have on the storage, premium storage that Sabrent has. So they don't leave any detail out of the way. Boxes, metallic enclosures for the SD card. So this is really Sabrent style. If you are a follower of the channel, we have seen many products from Sabrent. And in terms of build quality, the best that we have seen in the market. SD cards is not an exception. Now, speeds. Theoretically, these cards, I've got the 128 and 256. There's also a version 512 and one terabyte. So depending on the workflow that you have, the capacity that you will require, then you have on Sabrent. I will leave links down below. But in terms of speeds, uh, in theoretic numbers, they will reach 170 megabytes per second on writes and 270 megabytes per second on reads. I was able to get a little bit more peaks of 400 and I did test it out on my Mac Studio at the back and as you can see I was reaching 380 400 on right and then it will normalize and I was getting roughly 240 on reads I was saying it will normalize on the 200 mark and 240 on reads now if I use my MacBook Pro 14 inches right over here I was getting lower values we're talking about 240 on the reading and 170 on the writing side so depending on the reader that we have we can achieve faster or slower results if we use older adapters or older card readers then the speeds will get lower and in those particular cases i would suggest for you to take a look i will also leave links down below for these two adapters from sabrent these are the fastest that we can get this one right over here which is the sabrent usb type c sd micro sd adapter it has usb 3.2 generation 1 and speeds up to 312 megabytes per second so this will not bottleneck these fast cards we will be more than fine if you are using the new sd express cards then you also have this solution right over here which is awesome by the way both of them are built of a great aluminium enclosure so just it's not plastic it's not just something cheap that you can purchase it's a premium product it's a Sabrent product so once you try a Sabrent product you will know what's the feeling it feels like my MacBook for example all metallic and this one as well now this one we can choose which cable we can connect this is the Sabrent USB type C type A SD Express with USB 3.2 generation 2 and it will go up to 985 megabytes per second which is just huge so if you record a lot of files and you want to process them fast to your computer you want to copy them fast to your computer this is the card this is the card reader to go but you will need to use cards SD Express to take full advantage of it because if you are using just normal cards like this normal fast cards like these then this adapter is the solution now i did notice something between the computer integrated reader and these right over here which is these tend to be more consistent in terms of the speeds they will be less peaking in high or lower values and unlike the integrated on the computer which will give me 400 megabytes and then will normalize to 200 right over here will go on the 200 240 250 mark and that's about it so both of them will behave like this more consistency limits 312 megabytes and 985 megabytes that being said these are the fastest sd cards that i've used so far and if you ask me hey robert why are the reading speeds important especially because uh, we are okay recording 4k or 8k but once we pick the files and put them on our computer instead of waiting for half an hour or 40 minutes or something like that 
it is really fast. So we are talking about 270. In some cases, we have seen 400 peaks of 400 megabytes. And that is really important because in no time, I've got my files on my computer so that I can start working on them. That being said, hope that you guys enjoyed the video and if you did, so don't forget that usual thumbs up right over there, which is really appreciated on this side of the screen. My name is Roberto George, today with Savrant Rocket V60 and the adapters. And as always, I'll see you guys on the next one.